Local lawmakers are tackling high gas prices as they continue hovering right around $4. Today, Congressman Fred Upton met with several local business owners about how those steep prices are affecting our local economy. He outlined what he sees as possible strategies for a long-term solution. News Channel 3's Ryan Duffy has more on his plan. As we all continue to be forced to deal with gas prices right around $4, Congressman Fred Upton, chairman of the House Committee on Energy and Commerce, says he has some of his own ideas for a long-term solution. With 27 vehicles in his company's fleet, David Roy, president of Lake Michigan Mailers, is hit especially hard by increasing gas prices. He says so far he's resisted passing along increased costs to his customers. But what he's most concerned about, he says, there's no clear plan from officials in Washington. The lack of a plan coming from the White House, it's not cohesive, it's not uh, cognizant of, of uh, economic realities and technological advances that are being made. And it, uh, it, it, quite frankly, it's a schizophrenic plan. Today, he and other small business owners had a chance to talk about their concerns with Congressman Fred Upton. Upton, as chairman of the House Committee on Energy and Commerce, is hearing from business owners all over the country. Earlier, they said 425 gas by Memorial Day. We may be that by Easter. And already, we're seeing probably predictions of maybe five or even above that later on this summer. In the short term, Upton says increasing domestic drilling and production would immediately lower gas prices. We have lots of reserves. We ought to be able to tap those, particularly as we look at trying to help our businesses and families. So many of them commute 30, 40, even more miles a day. It is a huge impact. He says long term, he's pushing for an all of the above approach, renewable energy, but also increasing production, including building the Keystone Pipeline. Reporting in Kalamazoo, Ryan Duffy, News Channel 3.